Hey, it's Jake here at Habitat Solutions again. I'm out here this morning, cold morning here in late January, doing some trimming on some Streamco willows that I planted about 18 to 20 years ago, and they were nothing more than little cuttings, just like you see here. And uh, what happens is, is these grow at a pretty fast rate. Great deer cover, they rub on them, they scrape on them, they don't browse them too hard, but over time, they get dead wood and they kind of start choking themselves out and shading themselves out. So I'm in here going to do a really hard cut on this one today. We'll come back and show you what it looks like after I'm done. But I wanted to show you how simple it is to take cuttings. And you're always looking for fresh, fresh green wood. And you can see the bark is green here. So we would cut this at an angle. That'll be the, the end that goes into the ground. Then come up here where it splits and cut that off flat. This is what's gonna go in your bucket when you've got your bucket with about four inches of water in it until you gather about 50 of them or 100 or however many you want. If you're gonna get one or two, then you just cut them. And of course the ground's froze. I can't stick it in the ground today, but I wanted to show you just how easy it is. And all it's gonna take is a little bit of your time to improve your habitat and put these Streamco willows right where you want them. Great screening and really good habitat for deer and birds and a whole lot of other wildlife. Okay, so after half an hour of cutting and hauling away brush, we got this knocked down. There's, there's lots of green, new growth. Several of these are the brown ones. They're dead, but a lot of them have the green in them, so I'll get lots of suckers off of here. Probably take about two years, but in two to three years, it'll be right back the same size that it was before. I've, I've done it done this on other ones and this is how you go about doing it in this particular area in this soybean field a lot of rubbing and scraping here so they utilize this for cover a lot so just another tip from Habitat Solutions.